Hey, what is up, everybody? Mr. Noodle, Nate, anybody else who happens to be here, happy to see you all. Today we are going to play a little bit of Killzone on the PS2 as part of the PS2 gauntlet. It is a shooter exclusive to Sony consoles, one that I have been wanting to play more of for quite a while, but I never really got around to doing. Um, so I'm pretty excited to, to finally really give it a try. What do we got? Audio. I don't think we need to mess with any of that, except for subtitles. We'll definitely get that on. Always need subtitles and actually turn the speech up all the way too. Got to be able to hear people talking and reading what they say. And if you're happy to see me, you'd give me a snack wrap. <laughs> I can't just leave right this moment and get you a snack wrap. Now, can I? I'm a little busy at the moment, if you haven't noticed. Mr. Noodle. But if you want to snack wrap that bad, I'm sure we can get you one soon, love. No worries. Okay, I just need to get my game view up, and then we are going to get started right about now, actually. I had a toot about you wanting one. Oh, I did not have a toot. Calm down, Mr. Noodle. <laughs> she says DoorDash now. There you go. See, Mr. Noodle, you can just get one from DoorDash. <laughs> Maybe uh, Nate Alistair will show up at her door. <laughs> uh, no profiles on the memory card. That's fine. We'll just make one. Profile name. Oh, this is a... This is a very strange keyboard. <laughs> uh... It makes sense, though, actually. It works pretty well. I feel like I've seen this sort of keyboard before somewhere. There we go. That's us. We're stream, no caps, apparently, because whatever. Um, make sure to let me know, guys, if I need to move around any of the elements. The one thing, of course, with having a game be full screen, full screen, like totally full screen, is that, uh, yeah, it can be kind of hard to tell when things need to move around so do let me know if anything is kind of being covered up or needs you know the size change larger smaller whatever the case may be not at this time but normally you're the only one that stays out this late in her area <laughs> yeah yeah i mean to be fair there's only what two restaurants in our area open this late one of them being sheets. So select level. What do we got? We got Hellgast, Assault. Cool, cool. Uh, We'll try normal mode. I normally prefer playing games on hard mode, but in stream, I don't want to be stuck on something for literally ever. So we're going to, we're going to, we're going to take it on normal. Go from there. Can't believe I just had that entire cutscene play and forgot to turn on the audio. I am sorry, everybody. <laughs> I was being quiet so you could hear the cutscene. And my dumbass didn't turn on the game audio. Oh, Lord. It's a good start. It's a good start. We're doing well. Things are going amazingly. <laughs> oh, boy. All right, so it's a first-person shooter. Down is down. Up is up. I can't do that. I can't. It's just impossible for me to do. Nope. Controls, please. Advanced. Invert. Look. On. Definitely. Left-handed. No. Auto reload. Sure. Whatever. We'll leave everything else alone. The only thing I care about is... Oh, no. I hit revert, didn't I? Uh, no, no, no. Advanced settings. Invert. Thank you. Keep. Keep changes. 
So that's cool. I also saw that it just had like a full rebind thing. That's not something you see all that often on consoles. So that's cool. Happy to see that. All right, hold L2 to crouch. I think it said R1 to fire. Oh no. This is not going to go so well. <laughs> I have not played a shooter on console in a very long time. <laughs> And this feels very touchy. <laughs> this is going to be bad. Press the R3 button to zoom. Okay, well that makes it a bit easier. What distance? It says some stuff in the distance. Okay, I just got comms. Here they come. There they are. So, uh, off the top of my head, I don't really know the story of Killzone. I've played a little bit of one of them before. But I haven't played a whole lot, to be honest with you. So I don't know like any of the specifics of what's going on. I know those are the bad guys and we are supposedly the good guys. That's about it. That's about all I know. <laughs> Can we turn down the sensitivity a little bit actually? Cause it's feeling a little too high for me because I, like I said, do not play shooters on console. I, I haven't in a long time. Okay, they're attacking the right flank. Where at in the right flank? This is our right flank, right? Oh, you mean all the way over here. Are they coming down the... Nope. Where at? Where are they at, boy? There they are. It's alright, look. These dudes, these dudes got them. See, I didn't even have to do anything. I can just kind of fumble around, have no idea what I'm doing, and these guys will take care of all the hard work for us. It's fine. What is the reload button though? Triangle? Okay. Not bad looking for a PS2 game. I mean, it's pretty pixelated and the frame rate is looking like ass, but... <laughs> but other than that, like, it's not a terrible looking game. I can't tell really if we're hitting anything or not though. That's one small problem here. Oh, oh. Okay. Are there more? There are more. Oh, oh, oh. Am I being shot in the back? Holy crap. Where am I being hit? I have, like, no health left. What the hell happened? Oh, well, I think I'm dead. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what happened, man. It just, uh... All of a sudden, I just started taking hits in the back, and the next thing I know, I'm a dead guy. So... It's going well. It's going well. We failed already. <laughs> Let's turn, uh... Let's turn the audio just a little bit. Well, hey, you know what? I was just giving you guys a chance to see the voice acting, right? Because presumably, once we hit retry here... Um, ooh, I need to zoom out a little bit, don't I? Let me... Where's my remote at? Here it is. I mean, I could just move this screen up a little bit. Ah, uh, they changed it. It doesn't work that way anymore. Oh no. Okay, that's fine. We'll go into the menu. I'm still getting used to... This is my... I use a RetroTink 5X. And I'm still getting used to the new update. Um, vertical position. There we go. We'll just move it up a few clicks there. Something like that, maybe. Maybe that'll be okay. Oh, I don't like... I need the numbers. There we go. Okay, maybe that'll be okay. They added more features like the ability to save profiles and whatnot. Some really neat stuff, actually. But, um, I have not yet gotten used to it, so. Here they come. All right, so. We just gotta, we just gotta shoot. Just, just gotta aim and shoot. Uh, auto reload. Thank you. Honestly, I don't know how the hell we died on the tutorial mission. That uh, does not bode well for, for the rest of the, the game and our hopes of not being absolutely destroyed during it. But it's okay. I'm sure I'm sure everything's going to be fine. Can we... So if the reticules aren't turning red, can we still hit the guys? Or are they too far away to be, to be hit? I don't know, honestly. I see gunfire, but I don't see people. Oh, I just got hit by something. Hello? People? Ah! 
Okay, yep, this is this is going swimmingly. I'd rather you didn't. Kill him, that is. I mean, you can kill him, like those guys, but uh if you don't want to kill me, that'd be fun. I wouldn't mind living. Oh, right flank. I wonder, like, uh, maybe, maybe we should be pulse pulsing a little bit more instead of just doing. Ah uh, man, I wish there was a way to change it to like three round burst or something like that. Use left analog stick to walk around. Got it. I'm walking. I'm moving forward and backwards, side to side. 360 degrees of control. I'm taking a lot of hits too. Okay. Can one of you like take out that dude for me or something? Cause I'm on it obviously not doing a very good job of it, especially when these bombs are going off. Like, I don't know if there's any way to dodge those. Oh, that's uh, turns out I need to reload. I'm dead, I'm dead again. What am I doing wrong? <laughs> this is terrible. I mean, the other day when we were playing, the last game that we played was the Men in Black game. That game is hard as balls, man. Like, it is an insanely hard game. I didn't expect this one to give me trouble, though, to be honest. Outside of it being a, a first-person shooter and me not having a, a mouse. Outside of that, I thought this one would be fine, but... My lord. We've died twice on the tutorial mission. <laughs> like... Oh, I don't think he was talking to me. I think he was just shouting out that he's going to reload. <laughs> I just instinctively reloaded whenever he said, uh, shout it out, reload. All right. I don't know if I hit them or if somebody else hit them, but... Hey, some kill zone appreciation. Yeah, man, I've never really played the games. I've always wanted to. But I've never gotten around to doing it, and uh, so far I am terrible at it, so... <laughs> so don't expect a, uh, a particularly good showing, sadly. <laughs> Sorry, I got you a bad game, I just won't buy you anymore. Wait, did you buy this one, Mr. Noodle, for me? I honestly don't remember. And I definitely don't think it's a bad game either way, Mr. Noodle. I'm excited to play it. It's one that I've always wanted to, to play through. I just, uh... Oh, wait, you were talking about... You were talking about the, uh, the... Uh, what the hell is it called? The Men in Black game. That's the one you were talking about. I gotcha. Yeah, that one's not great. <laughs> I mean, it could be worse, though. Um, but yeah, it's just, it's just super hard, Mr. Noodle. Men in Black is. It's insanely hard. I couldn't, I, I was honestly surprised. Like, I thought it was just me or something, but I looked into it a little bit. I, I looked up the game to see if I was doing something wrong. And it seems like everybody kind of agrees that, that Men in Black Alien Escape or whatever it's called is just a tough as nails game. Duck down, reload. This game is great, just a bit of a learning curve with the aim and combat mechanics. Yeah, it feels a little like, it feels very, uh, very touchy with the aiming, which, you know, when I was younger, I probably wouldn't have minded. But nowadays I play mainly on PC, actually. I, I've started playing on PS2 again recently for the PS2 gauntlet and whatnot. But before, before this, I was almost exclusively a PC gamer. Um, and I got so used to keyboard and mouse that now trying to play a shooter with a controller is rough. <laughs> Give them cover and fire. We can do that. We can do that. Are you bad guy or are you good guy? I hope you're a bad guy. Because I'm pretty sure I shot you. 
All right. Are they here? They're here. There's a bunch of them here. Holy crap. Yeah, I have the... Uh, not only do I have this one, but I'm pretty sure I have the collection on... What was it? On PS3? Maybe PS4? Where it's got like a 1, 2, and 3? I think it's a PS3 collection, if I remember correctly. I have all those ones, and I uh, just never got around to playing them. And now that I'm doing the whole PS2 gauntlet thing, trying to play and stream all of the uh, North American PS2 games, at least all the ones that I reasonably can stream. I saw it as the perfect opportunity to kind of give the series a, a proper try. And for a PS2 game, it certainly looks pretty good so far. The frame rate seems to be a bit busted, but I've seen worse. X for melee, got it. Very cool, very cool. And I'm sure as I play it a little bit, I will get more used to it as well. The the aiming and whatnot, and reintroducing myself to first-person shooters on console with a controller. Uh, overheated? Yep. Oh, good, we can zoom in with this too. Excellent. I'm just gonna mow you down in the legs because <laughs> your legs are bigger targets than your than your heads. <laughs> I mean the the uh, machine gun here seems a little wild, anyways, just kind of firing all over the place. So as long as we uh, kind of aim in the general direction of the enemy, I think we might be okay. <laughs> Hopefully at some point they explain a little bit more of the story. That or I'll have to look into the, uh, the manual. Oh, shoot. Hi. Uh, sorry. Yep, I kind of ran in before you explained what I needed to do. My bad. <laughs> well, at least now we know we can use grenades. L1. Excellent. That is good information. I fell down. Did not mean to fall down. It's okay. It seems like maybe we need to go this way anyways. Hi. Uh, grenade? Is it gonna blow up? Okay, it did. <laughs> I was waiting for, like, some big boom or a flash or something like that. And then I just... Nothing. It was just nothing. Uh, you're a little slow there, Mr. Uh, enemy AI. With your... With your... Your firing. Of course, I say that, losing three quarters of my health to him, so, you know. Excellent. Got him. Sorry, I kind of alerted him that we were here. Ooh. Can you cook for too long? Oh, it's on the side. Okay, I see. It's got a nice little visual indicator there. I like that. To show you how far along it is cooked. I see, it looks like we got a different weapon. How did we switch? Has it told us that? Ooh, okay, circle. So we got a pistol and a shotgun as well as our rifle there. Very cool. So let's try the shotgun. At least I think this is a sh shotgun. All right. Oh no, okay, it's just a, a different kind of machine gun. Maybe a little bit, has a little bit of a, a tighter firing pattern it looks like which is excellent for me because my aim is bad enough as is oh man maybe maybe having a tighter fi uh, firing pattern isn't a good thing cool cool you'll need to cross the industries to get to HQ Hellgas are broken through they're already in this part of the city so be careful Good luck, sir. I mean, isn't the hell gas what we've been fighting this whole time? <laughs> I kind of knew they were already, uh, they were already here. That's not really news at this point, man. We've been fighting them all the way here. Oh, next area? Yeah, okay, cool. Hit efficiency, 19%. Honestly, better than I expected. <laughs> not saying that's good, but it's more than I thought I would have had. <laughs> Oh, I'm going to look at the box here while we're in the loading screen. 
In an era of planetary colonization, the Hellgast await orders to initiate a massive blitzkrieg on the outlying ISA colony, Vetka. Initiative will be attained, armies will engage, and lives will be lost. Keep Amidst the chaos, a squad of soldiers will become Captain heroes. Jack, Very cool. We pleased to see you, sir. We managed to hold our position against the first attack, but we're pinned down by sniper fire. There's a sniper rifle up the water tower. We can give you covering fire while you retrieve it. Let's go! Okay, I definitely need to... I was trying to avoid it, but I think I'm gonna have to do 1080p fill. Yes. Because it's just, it's just cutting off too much of the screen, sadly. And yeah, the cropping is basically turned off, so that's good. All right, now I just need to kind of, I should be able to do a custom. Yeah, there we go. Zoom in a little bit. Move it up. Uh, to right about there, give or take, and then stretch a little bit more. And go over all the way. Here we go. Once I get this set up, then thankfully it won't be uh, cutting off the edges of the screen anymore, hopefully. It may not be like a perfect 16 by 9 anymore by doing that, but... I think it'll still what? look fine. Yeah, it still looks fine. It's good enough. All right. So it said something about a sniper. Rifle. Where is the sniper? Yep, I will. Just show me where the sniper rifle is that I need to pick up, and then I will do my best. In top of the tower. You'll have to climb up this ladder to get the sniper rifle. Press and hold X to climb. We can do that. Oh, okay. Press and hold X to get on, and then use the stick to move up. The captions kind of went over top there. Hold circle to pick up. Ooh, ooh, okay. This is this is a this is a sniper rifle screen here. <laughs> Got him. Is that was there only the one or was there more than one? I think there may have only been the one. Ambush. So, oh hi. How are you? Uh, you're down. You're down. Nope. You would be if we didn't miss. Yes, I know you need support. I'm trying here. I know technically I'm your captain, but I'm probably the least experienced person here. <laughs> All right, we got it. We got it. It's all right. Y'all are fine. No worries. Oh, we can slide down the ladder. Very nice. Get down real quick. Do we still have our other weapons? Move Thankfully, on, it on, looks like on. we do. Are those... Advance. Okay, so we can't uh, have the aim pulled up while we're running around. That's very good to know. Another sniper. another sniper. That's fine. Where's he at? Is that him right there to the left a little bit? Uh, yep. No, don't. Oh, can I shoot you in between there? Hey, it worked. I didn't think that was going to work, to be honest. I'm happy that it did, though. Was that it? Or is there more? Hello, snipers. I think we're good. I'm ready to just be randomly shot and killed. Okay, let's go up in the tower. Maybe there will be more down in the next corridor. Oh, hi! There's a... <laughs> there are dudes up here. Uh, this is not going well. <laughs> can, you, can you guys just die, maybe? If you just want to die, that'd be fun. This is when I need a shotgun. Something with a real nice wide spread, because obviously I can't be trusted to to aim anything. 
I probably should have just threw a grenade. Here we go. We, we're just gonna we're just gonna do this. Did that take care of him? There we go. <laughs> that worked out much nicer. Hold a circle to pick up. So what is what is that? Is this the one with the the tighter firing pattern? Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah, we'll try it out. Why not? And then, are there any more snipers around? Doesn't look like it. I think I think we're in the clear. Okay, let's go back down. Let's meet up with the the group. See if everybody's ready to go forward. Hello, you? Yes, forward. This way. I'll go first if you want. Yeah, that's fine. Um. Hi. That's okay. See. Easy. Easy. That's all you had to do, man. Just walk forward. Oh, maybe not. What's, what's, what's incoming? Okay, let's go. I don't like all the explosions on this pipe right now, but, you know, screw it. It'll be fun. Okay. I... I like your guys' guns. Uh, <laughs> it's got a lot of ammo. I can't hit worth a damn, though. There we go. What, I really need to, like, pick up some health or something. Over here, Captain Templar. We need all the help we can get. Follow me. Where is... Okay. Say, saying over here doesn't help me very much. I don't know where over here is, bruh. Are we going? Are we going up? I was half expecting us to be ambushed again up here. Checkpoint reach. Thank God. What is a... Uh, is that the APC? I don't know what the hell I'm supposed to do about that. Oh, there's a missile launcher. Where? 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 Get down there. Is it just down here? Oh, that all? Oh, okay. Why didn't you just say that earlier? And then, do you have? You do. Excellent. Can we zoom in the same way? We can, but not with the fancy screen. That didn't seem to do it. Did I miss, or? Hey! Nice. Where are they coming from? A direction or anything would be handy. Hello? Oh, Jesus. Okay. <laughs> Just turn around and suddenly there's like 20 of them. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay. Are there more? There's one. I mean, I'm sure this isn't the best use for a freaking rocket launcher, but... It's fine. We can we can take out one guy with a missile, right? <laughs> That's not overkill at all. I think that may have been the last of our ammo for this, though. So hopefully we didn't need to use it anymore after this. <laughs> Come on, quick. I'm coming. I'm coming. Stay in line. Is this ammo? I don't think that was missiles, though. Which is uh, more or less what we needed. Oh, hello. That looks like another armored uh, vehicle. And I have what exactly zero missiles left? This is this is good. This is good. Um missiles anywhere? There don't appear to be. This is troublesome. Maybe if we just take out some of the, the dudes. Somebody else will take care of that thing. Is there a lean? I don't think there's a lean button. That would be handy, though, if there were. Ow! Bruh, I would appreciate it if you didn't shoot me. That'd be nice. 
Good. Good. Okay. Now what? Going back to the HQ. Come with us. We'll escort you to the HQ perimeter. Okay. We can do that. Run. So it looks like we might have a little bit of a stamina bar too right underneath our health bar. I didn't notice that before. Oh, that was actually the end of the second mission. Okay. Hey, our hit efficiency went up a little bit. We're getting a tiny bit better. Up to 21%. Still nothing to brag about, but you know. <laughs> oh, geez. Right. Uh, it's been about a half hour. I'm going to take a quick break and just stretch, get a drink, do all that good stuff. And then we're going to come right back to it. Have a little bit more fun with kill zone. See if maybe I can get to, to something... I was going to say respectable, reasonable, maybe uh, not terrible. How about that? Let's see if we can get to a hit efficiency. That's not absolutely terrible. 15 headshots. I'm pretty sure that was more of a mistake than anything. <laughs> Just accidental headshots is all that was. But yeah, we're going to we're going to hop over over to a quick uh, two minute break just so I can stretch, get the pre-roll ads off and do all that fun stuff. So be right back, everybody. to be a little bit showy you know why not that's us man number 69 forward basketballer born <laughs> 420 1900 <laughs> god that was the same and i think jack and daxter sly were my first games i got for it jack and daxter i don't know if i ever personally owned jack and daxter i have the collection now for ps3 but yeah, I, I know for a fact that one of my brothers had it, though, and I played it that way. But I don't remember if I personally ever did own it. So we can pick our attire. Oh, that's just our hair color. Well, whatever. I don't care about that. Hair, headgear, glasses, none available. Facial hair, we already did that. Chains, none available. Tattoos. Kind of tattoos we got. We got to get the Celtic tattoos, right? The traditional. Oh, wait. Okay. Never mind. All this stuff has to be bought. I thought it said we couldn't buy anything. <laughs> I thought it said it uh, all had to be earned. Oh, we going to be riding them freaking <laughs> elbow pads. One fine ride. I have no idea what any of this stuff is. We're just going to leave this part. <laughs> we don't need it. <laughs> Rides, friends, etc. We can, we can pick friends to be on the court side for us. Oh, Lord. What's that say? Escudo? Is that something? I don't know. Uh, specials. Holy crap. Two million? Two times juice replenish? Doubles the speed at which your juice meter. Okay. So I guess that's just stuff we can unlock later on. Auto save in progress. Gotcha. Yeah, I mean, I, I think I would like this game better than I like NBA Live. Although, I'll be honest, the hour that I was playing NBA Live passed pretty quickly for me. A lot quicker than the uh, NFL, even NFL Street, which, I mean, was relatively fun. But, yeah, I think it's just because I, I like basketball more than I like football, just in general, personally. Review episode. A round ball legend. What the hell was that? Is that the first episode of our TV series that we're star starring in? You see these old boys here? Network execs. They're trying to figure okay. out. Okay. This is just the, the cutscene from the beginning. We don't need to watch that again. One of these days, uh, Nate, we all need to get together and just play some old PS2 games and shit. We could do like some Mario Kart on the N64 or, or on the Super Nintendo or something. Awesome 007 Goldeneye. And then, of course, all the, the PlayStation 2 games that I got. Start tournament. Hope it, <clears throat> oh man, excuse me. Hope it goes well, Nate, your next 20 minute drive, and uh, be safe, man. It, 
It's calmed down a lot now, but it was very rainy earlier today. <laughs> Up around here. I am going to just real quick. Hey, Mr. Noodle with the five bit cheer. Thank you so much, love. I'm going to just real, real quick, I'm going to cut off just a tiny bit of the left side because I'm seeing that there's a little bit of color uh, smearing on the left. So I'll cut the same off the right side, just kind of keep things even-ish. Something like that. That looks pretty decent. Oh, although now we need to stretch it out just a little bit. Transform, edit, and we will do... Yep, was blinded here. I believe it, man. I ended up having a... Uh... I had... To take a trip not too far from where I live. Uh, about 20 minutes from here, around 7 o'clock, and it was pouring down, man. It was, it was bad, bad. Like, it was honestly pretty hard to see at points. Okay. I don't know what it was like up where you're driving at at the moment, but I can't imagine it was any better, really. All right. Uh, oh, I need to get that stupid thing off the middle of the screen. Let's uh, go into the next mission, shall we? I'm aiming for, so what? We went from 19% to 21%. Maybe this time we can hit a whole 25% hit efficiency, eh? Maybe. Fingers crossed. If we're lucky. I, uh, I wouldn't hold my breath about it, but you know. <laughs> we can, we can dream. We can hope. Captain Templer, the Hellgast attack has severely compromised this area. You're needed at headquarters. The only way to get there is through these shuttle repair bays. I need to fix my thing here. 1920. I wish this stayed synced, the settings between different scenes, but sadly, it does not. Oh, crap. That's not what I wanted to do. Ah! Uh, reset. Close. Oh, no. All right. <laughs> Transform, edit. This is, this is going well, guys. This is going excellent. Stretch to bounds. 1926. By 1086, and then just move it negative three pixels on both sides. There we go. Okay, that's better. Inbound jet bike. Inbound jet bike. What? Do we get one of those? I want a jet bike. Oh, it's in the sky. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why. I was thinking uh, by jet bike. I was thinking something a little closer to the ground. Not something flying through the freaking air. I mean, why didn't you say something, man? I'm right here. I'm happy to give you give you all the support you need, man. That's what I'm here for, after all, you know? To be terrible and uh, offer nice emotional support. All right, well, let's go. Don't just say it. Let's let's freaking do it, man. Are we going up top? Let's go up top. Get the uh, get the the height advantage, you know, the high ground. There's some one thing the Star Wars series has taught me, even though I've never watched any of them, but Episode Four, it's that uh, you always need the high ground, you know. They're all over the place, so we'll have to be careful. All right, we can we can we can be careful. Oh, holy crap! Okay, when you said all over the place, I didn't think you meant literally around the next corner. Maybe we're not being careful enough. <laughs> I like their weapon, I think, more than I like ours. It may be a little bit weaker, but I like, uh, it doesn't have as much kick, right? It doesn't jump around as much, and I appreciate that. Oh, yeah, just melee the crap out of that guy. He didn't stand a chance. Uh, this guy does, though, and so does this guy. We're gonna die. We're, we're dead. We're dead. Hi. Yep. <laughs> just shotgun to the face. That's all it took. <laughs> Crap. It's all right. We're, we'll try again. That's the wonderful thing about video games. We are literally gods here, right? If we fail, we just go right back in and do it all over again. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, so we know what to expect now, at least. That's uh, that's the one benefit, right? The the jet bike's gonna come in. It's gonna do its thing. We just kind of need to to wait for it to go through. Just kind of ignore it. It's just a distraction. That's all it is. And then we just gotta we just gotta shoot these guys. Some not so friendlies coming from. I don't actually know what direction this is, but coming from over here. You, know, you probably shouldn't run right in front of somebody that's uh, that's firing their weapon. I'm no weapons expert, but I think that's usually a bad idea. Let's pick up all this ammunition before we go up this time. Probably a bit more than we actually needed, but I'd rather have too much than not enough, you know? Especially since there's no, like, carrying stuff around or anything. Ooh. Oh, we have an actual, like, objective screen. Okay. I, I haven't hit the select button at all up until now, so I was just like, ah, I'll hit it and see what happens, and I guess that's what happens, man. <laughs> the whole game freezes up, and then it tells us what our objective is. They're all over the place, so we'll have to be careful. By all over the place, you mean on the other side and not this side? Does that mean I can, like, stealth around him? Ah, oh, what? Yes! Oh, hi. I'm trying to melee. <laughs> Okay, that uh, did not quite go as planned. I, <laughs> I thought I would be able to, to melee him a little better than, than what ended up happening. Nice. I think we actually got a headshot there. Semi-intentionally at that. So we still have a rocket launcher. Does that mean that weapons kind of carry over from one mission to the next? Or is that purely coincidental? It is really hard to aim. <laughs> and is that something to do with the 16x9 game view? Or like, does the game just run at this low of a frame rate? It doesn't seem like we can we can change it here. After this mission, I might go back out to the main menu and switch it back to 4x3 and see if the game maybe controls a little bit better. Because I... I I've played this game, the multiplayer, a little bit before. I never played through the story, but when I was younger, I played a little bit of multiplayer, and I don't remember the frame rate feeling this low. Maybe it's just because I wasn't as big of a PC player back then, so, you know, I just didn't have the same appreciation for high refresh rate that I have now. Maybe. I can't say for certain that's not what happened. He's dead, right? Okay, there's another one. Um, switch weapons. Where are they at? Where are they at? Where are they at? Hi, friend. I know shooting you in the leg isn't really like the best way to go about this, but... I'm scared if I try to shoot you in the face, I'm just going to miss. <laughs> so, legs it is. I killed them all, hopefully. Okay, well, that's not helping our goal of 25% hit efficiency. Oh, no, reload. Oh, don't switch weapons, reload. Got 252 shots. We are fine. Is there like an... Oh, it has a shotgun attached to it. I didn't realize there were like secondary firing modes. Holy crap. Okay, that's useful. I was wondering because it looked like we were picking up shotgun shells all the time, but then I never like picked up a shotgun. So I thought maybe it was just something that I kept missing, but nope. We have a shotgun strapped to the bottom of this rifle. Awesome. We've got company. Mission objective added. Is it survive? Is that the objective? Because that's what I'm struggling with here. Also, I'm being sh shot from somewhere. There's dudes in the bottom of the stairs. Are they shooting through the stairs? Are they over? They're over there, aren't they? They're everywhere. Okay, so they weren't kidding when they said that they're freaking everywhere. Holy crap. Thankfully, thankfully we got a little bit of regen. Uh, did my grenade kill you all? No. Looks like it may have killed one of you, though. That's handy. Ow. Oh, 
lord. Okay. Look, if I go down there, I'm gonna die. Do one of you mind just uh, taking the lead on that? Hey, they listened. That's... I don't know if I'm <laughs> happy about that or a little creeped out that I was able to ask them to, uh, to, to, to go down there, and they just did. Obviously, I don't think that's actually a feature, but <laughs> still a little bit weird. Can I can I sneak past you and just uh just a little bit there, bud? Thanks. Forward. I'm scared to move forward. I'm being shot. Why am I always being shot? Okay, I picked up all kinds of ammunition and stuff. I don't even know what half of it was for. There he is. Oh wait, did we get did we get ammunition for the We did, we got missiles. Say hello to missile. Oh, okay. One missile apparently wasn't enough. We're dead. We're dead. I knew we were dead. <laughs> I I saw that coming. I'm not sure if we killed ourselves or if they killed us, but either way, we have like no health left. And we are fighting that thing. It's all right. We we got this. Just we we only died what two times. It's fine. It's fine. Give it another go. Captain Templar, the Hellgat oh crap! We're starting back here again. I thought we got a checkpoint. Crap! <laughs> I could have swore we got a checkpoint at some point. Uh, it's all right. We're not gonna we're not gonna let it kill our spirits man that's what they're that's what they're trying to do they're trying to, to they're trying to make us lose hope to lose our resolve but we won't let them win no matter how many times they make us redo this same mission we will keep pushing forward until they've all been defeated or until you know the time that I have to play video games is up tonight ah eh, whichever comes first <laughs> You got a flat? That sucks, man. Do you have a spare in your, your car at least there, Nate? I hope you do, bud. Or uh, or AAA service or something? Yep, and yep. Yeah, perfect. Okay. Well, I mean, still sucks that you got one, but I, <laughs> I am glad to hear that you, uh, that you have a replacement at least. Alright, so... Can we... Oh, hi! Um... Can we melee you, maybe? Thank you. Damn, we did it without being hit. Why are you all aiming at me? Calm down. I'm not the bad guy here. What is this? Is this the sniper rifle? It is. Oh, hi. I. Why are you here? I don't remember there being two of you last time I was up here. I thought there was only one. I like their weapon better, so I'm going to keep it. Instead of our, our group's weapon. Cop pulled you over and told you you didn't feel the flat tire? <laughs> <laughs> God, man. Was it only like a bit flat or something? Or like, holy crap. I mean, the only times I've ever really got a flat... There was once, actually, if I think back about it. There was once that I got a flat that was a little bit hard to tell that I had one. Because um, it just like naturally kind of slowly went flat. And then if it weren't for the fact that it was being loud as balls, I probably wouldn't have known it. And, but the other two times, my tire blew out, so like it was, it was painfully obvious that that I had a flat tire. Am I still being shot from over here somewhere? I am. Holy, uh, please die. Hmm. Okay. I would like it if you would stop moving so I could shoot you. Is he dead, or is he just crouched down? I think he... Oh, no, he's not dead. He was just crouched down. Shoot. Can you please... I'm gonna die! <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Deep breaths. Everything is okay. Also, it looks like this here has some sort of secondary mode, too. Uh, nope. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, how are we not dead? We should be dead. We are dead. I really don't want to go down to easy, but I am so bad at first-person shooters on controller. That or, you know, like I said, 
the the frame rate here. I think we are going to go ahead and back out and try taking it down to four by three and see if maybe the frame rate feels a little bit better because four by three was a lot more common on PS2 than 16 by nine. So maybe it uh, has something to do with that. I don't know. Nate said hit a bump about five minutes ago, heard a noise on way up, was about to pull over when he pulled you over. Real nice guy. Well, that's nice of him, you know. All right, so aspect ratio normal. Let's switch over to the normal game view here. Um, I guess I need to close this too, probably. And then... Uh, OBS has not been getting along with my capture card for some reason recently. I don't know what it is. Okay, let's... uh. Turn on. All right, we're just gonna have to unplug and replug. That should fix it. Does every other time. No, I mean, I guess it's nice of him to, to let you know. Even if you were gonna pull over in a moment and check yourself anyways, you know? Okay. We got our capture. Oh, I forgot to... <laughs> I was like, why does it look so stretched out if we have it set to the right thing now? Oh, that's right. I'm telling my <laughs> retro tank that I want to look at it in widescreen. That's why. So we need to fix that too. Thankfully, that is super easy to do because I have a profile. One of the very many cool features from the new version of the retro tank software all right let's try that again and but in regular four by three play it the way i feel like it was more or less meant to be played you have a game in progress so let's continue has the rain mostly stopped at this point nate so at least you're not like out there in the middle of nowhere changing a flat in the rain because <laughs> that that really sucks Captain Templar, the Hellgast attack has severely compromised this area I mean I'm gonna I'm gonna hold my judgment but so far I think maybe it feels a little bit better honestly I think it looks a little bit better too in regular four by three mode here Okay, I mean, like, I'm probably still going to lose and play like trash, but that's just because I'm trash. Uh, I mean, I don't know. Maybe, maybe the frame rate's a tiny bit better? The UI elements and everything look better, though, in 4x3. I definitely feel like this game was meant to be played in 4x3, not in 16.9. Yeah, it stopped. You're in a city center. Oh, well, I mean, that's nice, too. Still sucks that you got a flat, of course, but could certainly be worse, you know? Could have no spare and be literally in the middle of nowhere or whatever. Are you in the middle of a run? Like, do you have somebody's order on you right now? Oh, those are those are good guys. Okay. We, we, we can be friendly with them. They're all over the place, so we'll have to be careful. Maybe there were two. No, there definitely weren't two guys over here before. I guess maybe the one's just coming down from the ladder and they weren't, or from the stairs and they weren't last time. Was on way to pick up. Okay, cool, cool. Did you just teleport? I'm pretty sure this dude just like teleported through the ground there. My Google Home speaker thinks I'm talking to it. I definitely wasn't. You, you can stop if you like. Thank you. Uh, all right, get out of the way. Can, can dude behind me, can you get out of the way? Or were we, were we stuck on geometry or the dude? I think we were stuck on the dude. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Get him, get him, get him. Can you just die, please? I don't remember there being so many dudes over there the first time we came through this. 
Oh no, wait, don't switch back to that. What are you what are you doing? Oh. Okay. Holy crap, they got shotguns. I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I feel so bad. If I just had a keyboard and mouse, this would be like not the easiest thing in the world, but this would be going so much better. If I could just if I could just aim with my keyboard, please, sweet lord baby Jesus. Captain Templar. You know, some games on PS2 do actually support keyboard and mouse. It makes me wonder if I could with this one. I doubt it, but I am curious. I'm gonna turn down sensitivity a little bit more even. Just turn it down all the way. <laughs> it's gonna be so slow to try to turn and look at anything. But if I can actually aim at stuff, I think we'll be doing a little bit better. This area. Captain Templar, the hell gas the jet bike. Quiet. All right, get behind the wall because the jet bike will shoot the crap out of us. Mr. Noodle says you seem to have bad car luck. Yeah, for real, man. <laughs> Like, you have some of the worst car luck, I feel like. <laughs> There's a uh, noob gun. Uh, uh, what's it called? A, a noob tube? There's a noob tube attached to this gun here. Our weapon. So theirs has a shotgun strapped to the bottom of it. Ours has a noob tube. Very cool. I don't know how it took me so long to figure that out, but... Now we know, I suppose. It's been so long since I've even played a first-person shooter, like a, a normal first-person shooter. Like, I couldn't remember what a noob tube was called. Had to, <laughs> took me a second to remember. I wonder why they're both spawning together now. Because they were definitely spawning separate the first time that I came through here. Maybe it has something to do with how long it took me to come through here the first time. Maybe one of the... The friendlies took out the uh, the other guy or something. Okay, we're gonna like go over here and then try to kind of take out this guy. Yes, that's what we want. I was hoping that the friendlies would come up here because then they can help out with the with the murdering of the enemies here. <laughs> And undoubtedly, their aim is going to be better than mine. <laughs> Had a headlight ball blow earlier, too. I saw your message about that in uh, Discord that you were posting, Nate. That is insane, man. <laughs> Instead of spare tires and parts, you just need to bring along a whole spare car, Mr. Noodle says. That's great. Alright, just, just run. Just run. And then... Holy crap, that was not the the right move. All right, in the interest of not replaying through the same level for the next uh, half hour that we have here, I guess I'm just gonna go down to easy mode, man. It feels bad just even saying that, but I'm gonna have to. It's just, I can't, I can't, I'm so bad with a with freaking controller, man. I need a, I need a mouse. I just, I need a mouse and a, a steady, like, no, it doesn't even have to be a steady 30, just an over 20 FPS. <laughs> uh, okay, so... Oh, not profiles. We want to we wanna stay on that profile. We want to go to options, visual, audio. Wait, can we change the... What are battlefields? That's the, the multiplayer, okay? That's what I played before. Modify. Statistics? What are, what are those statistics? Coward, fodder, hawk, brutal, berserker, death, headshots, kills, games won. Oh, that's all Battlefield stuff. Okay, the online or the, the multiplayer stuff. I was wondering, I was like, what the hell is all that? Can we change our difficulty after already having started? I actually don't know. I might not be able to. Maybe from in the game we can. So yeah, Nate, we just need to get you a, uh, oh, what are those things called? A trailer. And you can just load up a car on the back of your trailer. So when your main car breaks down, you can just swap, uh, swap them around, man. Captain 
pull your extra off the trailer and throw the, the busted one on it. Oh, no. I don't think we can. I don't think we can go down to easy mode. <laughs> Crap. So that means there, we have no choice. We just have to do it then. Is it gonna, is the, the tomahawk or whatever, the, the, the bike? Jet bike, that's what it's called. Is that gonna spawn in? There it goes, finally. All right, let the, let the jet bike go through so I don't get the crap shot out of me right from the beginning here. Very nice. And then we'll just uh, fire off a couple noob tubes. They weren't very good noob tube shots, but hey, I think I took down one or two. These dudes got some freaking armor on them. Pick up all of the ammo. Please, ammo and the weapon. I definitely prefer this gun to our gun. I, I wish the game would tell us a little bit more about kind of the world and the lore and everything, you know? Because I, I have no idea what's going on. The thing with, like, Call of Duty, it's set in basically real life. So you have a idea of kind of what's going on right with like who who the good guys are who the bad guys are you have a sense of all of that because we live in the real world most of the time so <laughs> so we, we we understand you know the the conflict and why one side we might want to support over the other or whatever but in this game like what what did the hell guests actually do that's so bad i don't know are they actually bad guys? It's the same thing with, like, uh, Star Wars. I have the same question all the time. Like, I, I don't like in Star Wars how the episode four, you're just thrown into it, expecting, or, and expected to, to hate the Empire and, uh, to support the Jedi, or, or at least Luke. I guess it's not the Jedi. He's the, the, the Jedis. It's just Luke and, uh, the Rebellion. There you go. That's, that's who it is. You just kind of expected to support them because the movie tells you to, and I, I don't know if that's necessarily the right choice, you know? Are the Rebellion really the good guys? What did the Rebellion do? They could be doing terrible acts for all we know, and the Empire could have been trying to save their people from the terrible acts of the Rebellion. That's kind of how I feel about this game, though. Like, so far, for all I know, the Hellgas are actually the good guys, and we are the terrible people trying to screw up the world. Is there another one that spawned in over here somewhere? No, okay. I kind of wish now that I would have picked up that sniper rifle. But that one time, that one time, the first time that we actually made it through here, we didn't need the sniper rifle. It all just kind of worked out. But every time since then, the enemies have been just freaking insane man okay we're gonna we're gonna switch not to the rocket launcher to this one i'm hoping this one will do a little bit better with range because the hellgast rifle is just firing all over the place it's got some wicked uh long range spread seems better for for close range than our rifle maybe is but our rifle seems better for maybe medium to long range even though it's got some nasty kick to it We, do we do it? Did we do it? Guys, I think maybe... Maybe we've made progress. Ow! I don't like shotguns. Not when they're shooting me! Holy crap. Where are my reinforcements? That's what I want to know. Oh, that hurt. I need health regen. Can y'all please take out those dudes while I just kind of cower here in the corner? Alright, this side's clear. That's good. Over here? Everything. Okay, you're not dead, but... Oh, did we pick up? I think we picked up a health pack, too. And there's dudes over here somewhere shooting at me, isn't there? I hear them, but I don't see... Ah, there he is. He's hiding. That's a sneaky one over there he is. Look at him. Just 
catching us in between the cracks. All right, I think one of my guys got him. I hope so. And before we just start being shot randomly again. All right, mission objective added. And what's the objective that it gave us? Reach the ISA HQ, destroy the hell gas tank, sorry. Oh crap, it's been another half hour. I didn't realize. Okay, well, uh, let's take a short break again, just for a couple minutes while I stretch, get a drink, and uh, get rid of those nasty pre-roll ads. So just two minutes, guys, and then we'll be right back to it. Uh, hopefully beating this mission and not dying for the, I've lost track, sixth time? Question mark. What? Choose your play per view. <laughs> not pay per view, play per view. So this is like a TV schedule? This is weird, okay. Interesting. Mr. Iverson's crib. Weather shizzle. Snizzle Fizzy's Big Score, 1976. That looks like a hell of a movie. Baller's Corner Educational. Some uh, interesting TV shows we got going on here, man. So is this uh, going to be like a full basketball game? Like, what is it, seven on seven or whatever? Or is it... No, wait. Six or five? Five on five, six on six? I don't remember. Something like that, right? Right around five, six. Or is it like one on one, two on two? I'm on the court at the Ruckus, hosting the amateurs, and that's how I come to play role in this Bramble Petty tale. I feel like there should be a cutscene playing right now, but I'm just getting a loading screen instead. Yo, Johnny, what's the hat, Sam? Hey, listen, we got this. It's like I don't know if y'all can hear it, but there's some. Man, it's not that dancing fish. Thing. There's some people talking here, but. But like all I could see was the <laughs> the loading screen, so Okay, that was that was weird, but just to let you know, ma'am, your schedule's pretty freed up. Yeah, I mean the problem is mine isn't. <laughs> Play to eleven, win by two, best of three rounds, two minute rounds, find hidden moves. Okay. Passing alley oop, fire mode. Okay, hold juice bu button to run faster and perform powerful moves. Use right analog stick to juke. Ah, I like that, okay. Press X to counter moves. I don't know. So what's, uh... Circle seems to be the, the alley-oop. How do you just do a regular... How do I just do a regular shot, though? I don't know how to do a shot. Hey, Mr. Noodle just subscribed. Thank you, Mr. Noodle. Appreciate you, boo. How do I... Man, I remember NBA Ballers. Actually, a pretty fun game. Took me a minute to get used to it, but... I had a fun time with that one. Which, uh, with my track record uh, with sports games, it's, uh, <laughs> that's, that's, uh, that's actually saying something. Oh, I am out of shotgun shells, okay. No shotgunning here, or, uh, noob tubing, I guess. Wrong weapon. Oh, nope, there's more. There's so many. Where else am I taking hits from? I would appreciate if you guys would like move up and maybe help out a little bit here instead of just hiding back here behind the barriers, you know? Yeah, there you go. Get down there. Help out. See, no, no, down here. There's, there's dudes right here and they are not nice people. All right, look, I, I got rid of him. Now you can come down here. Wait, wait. Off in the distance. Don't use the shotgun. Why would you use the shotgun over that distance? Don't be stupid. Oh, did we get him? I think we got him. Hey, Mr. Noodle with another 5-bit cheer. Thank you, love. Oh, that's a cute one, too. Show love one. Very cute. Thank you, Mr. Noodle. Ha, <laughs> Oh, I appreciate it. Really, I do. Thank you so much, Mr. Noodle. 
one of these days we need to get you up here to stream with me man you can you can you can help out we can play some multiplayer games together or something you can do uh you can do god of war right show everybody your your god of war skills oh i think there's where are they at I thought I, I thought I saw, I thought I saw fire coming from over there, but maybe not. You found a googly eye in your eyeshadow box? You're horrible at games now? I mean, look, <laughs> you've watched me play this game, this one mission now, how many times? Like, <laughs> it's okay to be horrible at games. You just gotta, you just gotta have fun with it. It's all that matters at the end of the day. All right, so. Since we killed the gunner, does that mean we're safe? I hope so. I swear, if I walk out here and I get instantly murdered again. Okay. I don't know what I got shot by. Maybe I do need to... Oh, is that like a homing missile or something, that one? Oh, that was my objective. Okay. I didn't realize that I had to destroy those. Is that friendly? I think he's a friendly. Yeah, it's green. Okay. We're safe. Was that the end? We were so close to the end at one point, man. We were so close, and then we just died right there. All we had to do was blow up those stu two stupid tanks, and we would have made it. That is infuriating. Our hit efficiency did go up a little bit though. Still only 27%, but again, with the first mission, I think we had what, 19%? So we'll take it. 27%, that's almost a 10% increase. By the time we're playing, done playing this game for the night, maybe we can make it to like 30, 32. Let's, let's, let's try to go for 32. All right, so we still have the Hellgas gun. We still have the missile launcher that's out of ammo. And then we have our gun. It looks like we're gonna be in slightly closer quarters maybe. So we'll, we'll hold the Hellgas one for now. Captain Templar, we've been expecting you. If you follow me, I'll take you to our CO. Very well, let's go. Can't follow you if you don't move, bro. You know what game I really want to get for, well, <laughs> I don't know necessarily if I want to play it on PS2 o over playing it on like PC or something, this way. but uh, Half-Life. I really want to try the Half-Life series too. That's another series that I've for years and years and years wanted to actually complete. I have tried Half-Life, but beyond that, that's like, that's it, you know? And now Half-Life Alex is out for VR. Which looks like a ton of fun. Why do you keep Captain hiding Templar. behind cover? Captain Templar. Glad to see you made it through alive. I keep General being scared Bolton that we're gonna get like shot this at or something because this dude keeps hiding. Oh well, maybe he had good reason to then. Get ready, people! We have to hold them off until our vehicles get here. Okay. Where are they? Oh, they're in their own vehicles down there. Okay. I see our hit efficiency going down rapidly. <laughs> we don't happen to have like ammo for the uh, for the uh, missile launcher, do we? That would be helpful in this situation. Can we, can we hit you, please? We're being shot. Fairly close. Hello. I see you hiding there. I would just like to say that it's not nice to come to my home base, hide in a hill, and shoot me. I don't appreciate it too much. Here they come. And by they, do you mean our guys or their guys? Uh, more of their guys. Yep. Okay more of our guys and it seems like they have some sort of mounted uh, machine gun or something hey. 
Very nice. Just walk into my gunfire. I love to see it. That was like right on his head. There's no way that I should have missed all those shots. I know I'm bad at the game, but like, come on. I was aiming on him. Oh no, there's so many. There's so many, they're so close. Why are there so many? Holy crap, do we have any health pickups or anything around here? No health, just, oh wait, there is health right there. Excellent. Can I shoot that dude out of the tank looking thing? Okay, he finally found his mark. Wait, I think he's dead. I think he's dead. But I don't have missiles, do I? Did I end up getting some? No. Oh, I did! Just one, apparently. Okay, well, I guess that's what we need to do. <laughs> there, there, there what? You can't just, <laughs> you can't just start a mission, or a mission, a sentence like that, and then just stop. Oh, no. Where is Captain over here? Who said that? Ah, over here. On the other side of the wall. The wall that we were defending. That makes sense. Captain, I've been sent to take you to General Fawn. Please, follow me. Okay, lead the way. I'm trusting Clear you, man. Ahead. It better be. If I get shot at, I'm gonna turn around and shoot you. I hear gunshots. This isn't looking well for your assessment on it being clear. Oh, yep. See what I mean? You tell me it's clear. And next thing I know, I have guys all over the place trying to murder me. That shotgun does not do as much damage as I would have liked it to do. <laughs> Uh, die, please. Thank you. I, I appreciate it when people do. What? How do I shoot on both sides of him? Like, I try to lead the target, and then he just instantly stops. Either the AI is cheating, or I am really bad. And I think we all know the answer. <laughs> Any ammo or anything to pick up? No, doesn't look like it. Ooh. Okay, some just regular ammunition, nothing, nothing crazy. There's a machine gun upstairs that we can use. Cool. I would love to if I could get off the freaking geometry. I still can't tell for sure if the frame rate's any better or not, to be honest. I think it may be slightly better, but it's really hard to say. Just keep pulse firing. So we don't want the thing to overheat, but that's our guy over there, right? Yeah, if we keep pulsing, then it can it can cool down pretty quick. And thankfully it seems like nobody really cares about us up here. Like we're just the dudes in the mounted freaking machine gun shooting you in the back, but it, it's fine. Don't worry about them. Just worry about the one single guy on the other side over there. <laughs> it's a good tactic. Or, okay, two guys. I'm sorry. There's two. Is that it? Is that all I had to do? Do I go over here now? I feel like there should have been more to it than that. I, I, I feel like I'm missing something. Next room? Huh. Oh, maybe that was it. Okay, whatever. Uh, no, I was pressing down. Come on. We're going down the ladder, not up. Jeez, man. Jonathan and I, my co-host for the Just One More Level podcast, we were talking a little bit. We want to get the podcast up and going again. It's nothing that we ever officially stop doing. But uh, just because of life, we haven't had as much time to record episodes recently. But we're hoping to be able to start recording again here soon. And I would really like to get his opinion on this game. 
I don't think he plays a lot of first person shooters, but I do know for certain that he's not as much of a PC gamer as I am. Like he he's more experienced in the ways of a controller. So I'm interested to see if it's just like the 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 uh, viewer said earlier with there being a bit of a learning curve to the game or if it's more of like a frame rate control problem you know like if it's just something that you can you can learn relatively easily to deal with or and like like skills from other first person shooters on console transfer over nicely if it really is its own sort of own sort of deal that you gotta learn i'm just curious to hear his opinion on it you know it's one of the nice things about jonathan being my co-host for that podcast is we both have vastly different experience with video games you know and that really helps to get a a better picture on different viewpoints of video games and different ideas on on we have different ideas on what make game make games good what makes them bad what um what genres that we like so it's always nice They're to get another another perspective Mandarin, from someone so relatively different you gonna you gonna open the door for me there bud there you go guess that's the end of that mission that one wasn't too bad relatively short one oh cutscene. okay cool a little bit of lore maybe the lore is there are people looking at screens. <laughs> I'll be shuttling up in um... within the hour, General. Yeah, within the hour, and I expect everything to be ready when I arrive. Yes, sir. Damn. Uh... Uh, it's good to see you, Yan. You too, General. What's happening out there? Are we holding? Well, it's impossible to tell with the comms as they are, but we're being attacked by the Third Helgen Army led by a General Lente. If Helga's ships keep on flooding in with more troops, we may as well pack up right here, right now. It's so much for taking them out of the sky before they land. Yeah. What's the latest with the SD platforms? Uh, General Adams is trying to get them operational again, but they need complete reprogramming. I have to get up there with a security key to override the control failsafe. I'm just waiting for the damn key to arrive before I head up for the shuttle. Any news from Earth? I mean, we're gonna need some heavy firepower to root these bastards out. Well, as we heard, they're sending the cavalry. We just have to hold out until they arrive. Jan, I... I had you brought here for a reason. A mission. I was hoping you'd... What's the brief? We have an infield operations agent working for us behind enemy lines. A Colonel Haka. A spy? infield agent Jan so um, yeah a spy well, a few hours ago we received intelligence saying he discovered information vital to our cause he's joined an ISA platoon holed up in this mall in the slums now, since then we've heard nothing we need him back Jan and quickly the enemy want him too oh, I think our best chance is a small team traveling quickly I understand sir I'm on it very cool. I wonder how long until the reveal comes out that there's been a spy in our mist the entire time. Because <laughs> I feel like that's what's going to end up happening. Hey, our hit efficiency actually did go up a tiny bit. 28% from 27, right? Or did we? Yeah, we were at 27 last time. To be honest, I thought it would have went down. I felt like uh, <laughs> that was a pretty poor for performance in that last mission there. I think we may have just enough time to get through one more. We're going to try to get through one more. Oh, wait, we get to pick different characters now. Well, I mean, we only have the option of picking the one actually at the moment, but so, oh, what? Does that mean it branches off into like four different stories or do you just get a, to like each one has a different specialty? Oh, now I'm, now I'm even more interested though in the game. I'm curious all of a sudden. So that whole first part was just like an introduction, it seems like, or something. Are you okay, Jan? I'm organizing an evac. The security key. Did it arrive? 
No, it never made it. I'll get it and meet you back here. Okay, head for the research unit, but be careful, Jan. They're swarming in. Oh yeah, no, that's fine. Just uh, I'll take care of it myself, man. I'll, I'll take down the entire enemy army, get you your key, meet you back here. Probably gonna find you dead and then have to take the security key up myself. It's fine. It's fine. Yeah, just leave it all on me. I mean, I am an immortal god, essentially. That can also rewind time. So, like, you know. The fact that I haven't just already saved all of our lives before, like, it got to this point is kind of terrible, actually, if you think about it. But, you know, it's fine. Don't think about it too much. Just, just, I'll take care of it. I got you. No, no worries. Also, it seems like uh, I may have gotten a small team of guys to, to help me out, at least. That's nice. Do I still have the same weapons as before? No, I, I have a pistol now and whatnot. So, I'm guessing it, it's completely reset. Oh, no. Mr. Noodle with another 5-bit cheer. Thank you, love. I feel like it hasn't even been that long since you did the last one. You are spoiling me tonight. All right, so the pistol, it's not terrible. I had to try it. I love pistols in video games, or in first-person shooters, most of the time. Like in uh, Halo, Call of Duty, I, I love the pistol, but I don't feel like it was doing enough damage here. What do you mean you won't do them anymore? I was just saying thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. I like you donating your little bits to me. It feels good. <laughs> Okay, I'm probably gonna die. I feel like the frame rate's tanking now too again, so that's good. <laughs> um, did we pick up the the hell gas weapon? Is that what we just got? Yeah, not a whole lot of ammo for it though. Nate's still fighting with the tire. Holy crap, man! You need you know with as much driving as you do, if you don't already have it, you should really look into getting like a AAA membership or something like that. It's not exactly cheap. I think it's like $100, $120 a year or something along them lines. But I mean, like, it could really save your butt, you know? Like, say say your your spare tire just happened to be flat whenever you uh, you go to put it on or something like that, you know? If you had AAA, they could, they could come haul you out or, or put it on for you in situations where maybe you can't get it on or whatever. So I don't know if you've ever looked into it, but yeah, I think, uh, I think maybe you should, man. Okay, they didn't just advance, they came out of freaking nowhere. Holy crap, and there's so many of them. I can't tell if that dude's dead or crouching. He was crouching. Uh, my shotgun was empty. Oh, we hardly survived that. Is there a health pack around here somewhere, maybe? Also, it's very dark in this room. Can I have a flashlight? Hey guys, hello, uh, uh, friends. I can't, I can't get over this table. Uh, do you have a flashlight? Anybody? No. Okay. Well, I could really use one. So if anybody sees one like laying around anywhere and just wants to pick it up and let me know, that'd be helpful. Come on, come on. Uh, I'm stuck on geometry. Ah, uh, you're so close. When you put the lugs on, use the power tool, but they're on there good. Oh crap, have you gotten any of them off yet, Nate? I I hope so, man. You've been working at that for a little while. Nope, holy crap, man. Where? <laughs> uh like do you need do you need some help or something like <laughs> i don't want you to to be stranded out wherever you're at man getting ready to watch a youtube video okay <laughs> all right man take your time i hope you uh, i hope you get it figured out if you end up needing something you know text me on on or just text me or, or discord me or something like uh yeah <laughs> I would think with the small corridors that we're in right now that the frame rate would be a little bit better, but it actually seems to be a little bit worse. 
<laughs> oh, we're out of ammo. I should have paid more attention. Oh, shotgun to the rescue. Hey, don't, don't look over here. Keep looking off in the distance over there. Weren't there like some pretty flowers or something for you to be looking at? Also, we're gonna die. I need to regen a little bit of health. All right, deep breaths. Everything is going to be okay. All right, we got this. We just, you, you just gotta believe, you know? If you believe hard enough, anything can happen. Uh, also, grenades help. Shoot those bastards! Why don't you That's exactly how I feel. Whoever shouted that out, yes, you are my soulmate, actually, because... <laughs> Alright, I was hoping I could get a grenade in there, but... Ah, oh, what? The grenade, like, bounced off the glass. <laughs> I must have the world's weakest throwing arm or something, man. Holy crap. Okay. I'm gonna try to go from a little bit of a distance here on them. Where are they at? There they are. I can't. I can't. I just can't, man. Oh, no. I, I can't say that. No, we got this. That's what I mean. We got this. We're gonna throw that grenade in there. It's gonna blow them up, and we're not gonna die right here. Crap! <laughs> Shot in the back. We were so close. You're back? Welcome back. I just got shot in the back. <laughs> was your uh, was your YouTube video uh, helpful at least there? I hope it gave you some good insight on what it is you need to do to <laughs> hopefully get that uh that darn tire off there all right, we're gonna we're gonna try this again just gotta believe in ourselves the power of positivity everything is gonna be okay i didn't mean to shoot you in the back i'm sorry bro uh there's so many. I can't get out of my way. You're a freaking moron. <laughs> Call me a moron. Uh, okay, one not down. I thought we hit him in the head. How are you still standing? Just freaking die, man. I... <laughs> I still want to play this series... But I think whenever I come back to it, it's going to be on the PS3 collection. Because I'm really hoping it'll play a little bit more smoothly. Mechanically, I'm enjoying the game so far. But a mix of the frame rate and me just being bad with the controller is making this... The, the actual firefights here really freaking rough, man. I want to... I, I really... If I knew where exactly my copy was... If I didn't have to dig through my box old games for it, I would probably try the PS3 version now just to see if it's better. I, it's gotta be. It's gotta be. Nope, but F it. I'll get from Pure Rage like any mechanic. <laughs> I believe in you, bud. And I don't know if you heard me earlier, but if you if you end up needing some help or something, man, let me know. Like, I don't want you to be stranded out in, uh, well, wherever you are exactly. But uh, just, like, you know, text me or whatever, obviously. Don't put it on on stream but if you end up needing something just let me know man i'm uh, i'm far from a mechanic myself but i've changed a tire or two i, I might be able to help out <laughs> all right so i'm just i'm just uh waiting a, a moment here trying to <laughs> trying to let our health regen a little bit because we are very hurt there may be a health pack in the hallway up here. At least it seemed like there was the last time we ran through here. One of these guys seemed to have dropped one or something. But that may have just been luck. I don't know if they always drop the same things. Or which guy exactly it was that we killed that dropped one. I hear them yelling advance. I don't want you to advance yet. I'm still half dead. Advance after I regain health, please. Or just not at all. Actually, if you just want to, you know, get in your ships, turn around, and go home, that would be perfectly acceptable as well. Honestly, like, I don't think anybody would be mad at you. 
Well, okay, whoever your leader is might be a little bit mad at you, but... Come on, do you really care what that guy thinks? I don't think you do. Message me on Discord when I get the chance to check? Okay. I can pull up Discord real quick. We have Discord if you... <laughs> I... I know what you meant, Mr. Noodle, <laughs> but I think you, uh, I think you, uh, messed up the, <laughs> the, the message there. But yeah, Nate, just shoot us a message if you, if you can't get it, man. I hope you can hear me. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, I can, I can come try to help you get the tire changed or whatever, or whatever we need to do. Pure Rage for the win, you got it? It's coming off? I hope it's coming off for you. Oh, crap, man. No, don't run away. Go closer. We could have used melee. Oh, I forgot melee existed. We're running out of time for the stream tonight, but I really do want to get through this mission. We're going to try it one more time. One more time to get through this mission. And then win or fail, you know, succeed or fail, whatever the words are. <laughs> whatever the words are we are going to call it for the night but we got this we can we're gonna get it this time i feel it in my bones yep now just gotta rejack it up awesome man i i really am happy for you that <laughs> that would have sucked if you were stuck out there well again i wouldn't have left you stuck out there but still if after all that you weren't able to get it that would have sucked uh, do I have a noob two? I do. Noob two for the win. I'm pretty sure my friendly just shot me in the back. That wasn't too nice. I am about to kill you just out of spite. You freaking... Mm. One of these dudes just shouted in such a way that made me think of a freaking Dalek from Doctor Who. I don't like how much it jumps up. There we go. And we got this. You broke your side view mirror off with a trash. <laughs> I think. <laughs> oh man. I don't know if door dashing was the right choice of career for you, bud. <laughs> you have the worst luck with cars I've ever heard of. <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> Between yours breaking down, getting one that ran perfectly fine, and then all of a sudden stopped running as soon as you got it. Lost your rear view mirror. Flat tire, I mean, flats happen. But then you got a flat tire and a busted bulb on the same day. And to top it off, they were, the, the lug nuts were put on so hard that you couldn't get them off. <laughs> like... <laughs> Most of these things happen while you're not dashing. That's very true. I can't argue with you there. You are right about that. But uh, you have a track record, though. <laughs> You've set a precedence that is worrisome, <laughs> considering that you uh, you make your living off your car. <laughs> All right, come on out. Come back around the corner. I just want to say hello. Oh, I forgot to reload. Don't come around the corner. I don't want to say hello. I said I didn't want to say hello. God, they don't know how to listen, I swear. Rude people. I was going to say it'd be nice if one or two of my friendlies came to help out, but you know what? I kind of understand why they wouldn't. One, they're all dead. Two, the one re uh, remaining one, I kind of shot a couple times. Just once or twice. Purely accidental. Just, uh, don't check me on that. But, but believe me, it's purely accidental. What's funny is most of your issues had nothing to do with the driver, excluding the tire and the mirror that was on me. How was the, the tire you? I mean, I know you said that you hit, like, a bump or something, but, I mean, can you really blame yourself for that, you know? I mean, there's gonna be bumps in the road. They're gonna, some of them are unavoidable. But... Yeah, I mean the mirror. I don't. I don't got anything there for you, bud. That sounds like that was probably all you. But <laughs> hey, I'm not perfect though. I hit a uh, wood pile one time gently. Thankfully, didn't uh, didn't break anything on my car. I might have left a little scratch, but 
other than that. Oh man, you could literally see them spawn in. Oh wait, was that? I think that was a friendly. My bad. Oh, we did not throw that grenade very far, did we? Can we throw a little bit farther, maybe? I thought we were a trained soldier, not a freaking Little League baseball player. Like, Actually, you know what? That's mean. Little League baseball players could probably throw farther than that. <laughs> I was thinking like, ah, oh, a big group of people just spawned in. You know what would be an excellent way to get rid of them? A freaking grenade. Oh, wait, no. We can only throw it six feet in front of us. Like, freaking trash, man. Hit curb turning into Dollar General. Yeah, I'm, I've am i hit a couple curbs in my lifetime, too. <laughs> Thankfully, I haven't popped any tires with it, but... <laughs> but, yeah. I can't say I haven't done it. <laughs> Should have folded in. It was like, nope. <laughs> Does that car have mirrors that fold in? Because not all cars do, right? Fairly certain there's some that don't. I don't think mine do. I've never tested that, but I don't think they fold in. We uh, can we hit you maybe? All right, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna jump the ledge here. We got this. We've we're doing relatively well. I don't wanna I don't wanna jinx it or anything, but so far we've we've made it the farthest we have yet, and we have full health, and we've got uh one or two friendlies back to help us out, which is always nice. Let me do a quick reload. I just realized we are basically out. Sparky bars? Fizzed? Fizzed sparky bars? How, is that like uh, like Pop Rocks, but in a candy bar form or something? How does that work? I want it to eat one now. Uh, hello? Anybody? Uh, is that... There's a big crack in your wall. You might want to get some, some filler of some sort there. Oh, you're friendly. I... Oh, checkpoint reached. Very cool. Private Billinghurst at your service, sir. I'll help you. Ah, thank you, Billinghurst. <laughs> I appreciate that, soldier. If I could make it through the doorway. Look, just uh, <laughs> ignore the fact that I'm walking around like a drunkard right now, uh, Mr. Billinghurst. I, I swear I am fighting fit. Your life is in good hands. I'm not drunk, I'm just very, uh, you know what, honestly, you just, you don't know what good, what, what, what the peak, um, hmm. yeah, I've got nothing. <laughs> You're screwed, man, we're both screwed, I'm sorry, you picked the wrong team to, to join up with here. Where did you go, Billinghurst? You left me, and now I'm all alone, and I'm scared, I don't know where we're going, Oh no, I really did get lost. How did I get lost? Is there, ow, ow, okay, fire hurt. We came down this way, did we not? Yeah, we came through here, I got stuck on this door. And then we came through here, together. That's a plant, not like a staircase or anything. That's burning me whenever I go over there. So we don't go over there. Oh, maybe this... Maybe this is the way to go? Oh, is that a door? I think maybe we found somewhere. It is so dark. Why is it so dark? Hold on. Is there like a screen adjust or something? No, there's not. There's nothing. Okay. <laughs> It's so dark, I can't see where the hell we're supposed to be going. Um, so I can't go over there. We came, would I like a mochi? Um, I would, but at the moment I can't. I'm, I have a lozenge in at the moment, love. Thank you though. If you, ah uh, no, I think I have too, too long left. I was gonna say if you want to sit one out to start warming up a little bit for me that'd be okay but okay here we go found it found it that was why was it so dark that was unnecessarily dark also are you just not going to acknowledge me at all just oh there you go you just had to think of oh no you're not you just turned away from me that was freaking rude man oh. 
Uh, somebody's got a target, and I hope that target's not me. Ooh, what kind of gun is this? Switch to the pistol. Let's switch it out for this. Is it a freaking grenade launching pistol? Got a blown tire and you're still like 50 short of what you need for gas bill and you want to try mochi? That sucks, man. I, uh, I wish I could help you out in that regard. I can't really do much for you there. But, uh, next time I see you, I'm happy to give you some mochi ice cream because <laughs> they are delicious. They, they sell them at Walmart now. Walmart and, uh, I believe, Giant Eagle both sell them in the freezer section. It's just like a, uh, the, it's mochi ice cream, to be specific. So, they, uh, there's, like, what? There's strawberry, I think mango, um, vanilla, that's what we have, cookies and cream, and then I think matcha-flavored ones are pretty common to find, too, although... I don't remember seeing any at Walmart. Oh, and chocolate. Yes. Yeah, Mr. Noodle. There's chocolate ones as well. They are pretty dang great, to be honest with you. It's like a sweetened rice thing <laughs> wrapped around uh, ice cream. And it is delicious, man, if you've never tried it before. Are you enemies or are you friendlies? You're friendlies. Okay. Uh, okay. Coming from the right. We got it from Aldi before, too. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. We have got it from Aldi before, too. So, yeah, they're basically all over the place, then. <laughs> like... <laughs> and if they have it at Aldi, they probably have it at uh, Trader Joe's for anybody else that's watching or ends up seeing this later on if you want to try some mochi because Aldi and Trader Joe's are I mean they come from the same company at least two different entities now but holy crap this dude hurts go down please thank you anybody like uh, drop a health pack or anything maybe that'd be cool I uh I really do think I'm going to try this game again. Probably not tonight because it's getting pretty late and I'm fairly tired. But relatively soon. Maybe after I beat like Final Fantasy 7 or something. One of the games I'm playing in my own personal time. I will, uh, I think I'm going to try this out on PS3. Because again, I'm really enjoying it like mechanically. I think it's great. But it is so freaking hard to aim. And I don't think... Could be wrong, but I don't think it's completely just me being bad. <laughs> I think the game is partially to blame. Oh, hi. You know, it was nice when, like, three seconds ago I had a couple other guys around to help me out. I don't know why none of them followed me down the corridor here, but, uh... It's, it's fine. I can be a one-man army. They sell single mango ones at Walmart? Really? I have not seen those ones before. I'm kind of surprised I haven't seen those before. But that's pretty cool. That'd be an excellent thing for people uh, that want to try it or whatever. Like, don't know if they like it. Just buy a single. Plus, the mango one was pretty good, if I remember correctly. Local Walmart, 98 cents. That's very cool. 98 cents isn't too bad either. I mean, they are kind of small. So, like, don't expect something huge for your money. But, whatever. It's 98 cents, right? It's not that bad. Okay. I don't know if there's somewhere specific I need to be going. Still got one stuck that you thought was loose. Ugh. Well, at least you're down to one now, right? Because you were at... All of them. I don't know how many your specific vehicle has per tire, but <laughs> that's uh, that's progress at least, right? Five, yeah. So, I mean, hey, you know, look at the bright side. Uh, I'd rather if you didn't kill me and instead died yourself. That's a cool idea. We've got to be getting close to the end of this one, right? Uh, is there a guy around the corner? 
Nope. Okay, well. I I don't know, like, with cooking grenades, if they'll blow up in your hand in this game. I've got a target. I'm assuming they would, so I'm not gonna hold it for too long. Ooh, are we are we on the top and bottom now? Are we fighting from both sides? Excellent. Yes, distract them for me while I murder them. I think I just blew myself up. <laughs> that that didn't go so well. Yeah, the brand that we buy is called My Mochi, and according to Mr. Noodle, they say they have a s'mores one, which that would probably be excellent. Ah, uh, I wonder if maybe, like, they would make the mochi itself, like, marshmallow flavored or something. That would be really good, in my, in my opinion. Like, a, a marshmallow flavored mochi, the, the rice part of it, and then have the actual ice cream be, like, the chocolatey goodness. Ah, Dolce de Leche. Very cool. Well, I don't think any of our stores around here sell either one of those flavors. But I absolutely love Dolce de Leche. That is some excellent stuff right there. We'll have to, one of these days, go to, uh, like, one of the nicer stores, like a Kroger's or something like that, and see what other flavors they have, love. Oh. Requesting assistance in the courtyard, okay. Sir, we need you at the courtyard. Need you at the Follow courtyard? Me. Follow me. I'm assuming that is Forward. this way. My headset also just died, so oh oh that was it! Okay. Cool, cool. Hey, 30%! Our efficiency went up. It's not quite as far as I was hoping to get, but uh, you know, it's 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 better than what we were. We're making constant improvement, and at the end of the day, that's all we can ask for, right? my headset died so i'm gonna plug that in real quick and then we're gonna ps for a moment and sign off because i need to get some sleep at some point Whew. well let's be honest i'm gonna be up for another like three hours at least because i always am but <laughs> i'm exhausted nonetheless what all have you said? Uh, Mr. Noodle said, we haven't been to Giant Eagle in a while. Very true. They might have it now. There's a lot of flavors. The Dolce de Leche is, oh, like it's a ice cream filled with Dolce de Leche inside it. I won't eat it. I'm guessing it's like just 100% sugar or something then, Mr. Noodle. Yeah. <laughs> Does it say like how much sugar is in it exactly? Does it give you an idea or? Oh, it's coffee ice cream. Well, I mean, like, I can still eat it. I try not to consume too much caffeine, but... Like, a tiny bit here and there or whatever's fine. There's some in chocolate, and I eat chocolate all the time. Dark chocolate and whatnot. And filled with Dolce de Leche. I mean, that so sounds... With... That sounds really good. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. I wouldn't be against trying it, at least. I would like to see if there's any sort of information anywhere on just how much caffeine there is in it, but I doubt there's more than, you know, like, a tiny bit. Unless it's made with pure concentrated espresso or something, you know? A lot of things like that, I find, are made with, like, decaf coffee anyways. So, who knows? 19 grams of carbs? That's not actually that bad. I, I think... I mean, that's not nothing, obviously, but I think the vanilla one that we have has, like, 20-some grams of carbs. Because I think it's, like, 20 grams of sugar, plus then you have the, the rice, which is carbs, of course, so... Yeah. But all right, I thank you all again for joining me. Nate and Mr. Noodle, of course, my two top supporters. And uh, anybody else who hopped in and maybe just hung out for a bit or uh, just stopped and watched and left or whatever, I appreciate you guys for coming in and hanging out with me for a little bit. And I hope to see you again. I can't look at my schedule at the moment. Well, I can as soon as I remember to pull it up here tomorrow yeah tomorrow i am going to be playing some lord of the rings of the third age it's been oh man it's been probably like a little over a week and uh normally i would play that game on sundays that's my normally scheduled 
day to do it. But with the way work's been and whatnot lately, I haven't been able to stream on Sundays. And I miss playing the game. So I want to do a little bit of it tomorrow on Wednesday. Probably going to try to do maybe four hours. I have it marked down for four hours. We'll see how I'm feeling tomorrow, whether we do all four of it or not. But uh, yeah, so I hope to see some of you or all of you, if possible, <laughs> back again tomorrow. Everybody have a good night. And uh, thank you again. Bye-bye. Oh man, that invisible wall back there, though. There we are. Okay. We're starting to catch up. You didn't because you hate me? Why do you hate me, Mr. Noodle? It's not very nice. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> oh, what's wrong, Mr. Noodle? You, you mad for some reason? You mad, bro? Alright. 8-6, though. We ain't doing too bad now. The second round here. How did I... How did I drop the ball? Ah. Trash. I am not being mean. You're being mean. Ah. Come on, I ain't got no juice left. I need some juice. Crap, we're gonna lose. <laughs> First game, we're gonna lose. Why didn't you dunk it? See if you subscribe to me again? Rude? How am I being the mean one? Got a tie on that one. Okay. Okay. Come on. Yeah. 